Continuing coverage tonight on a deadly drunk driving crash. Green Bay police say the victims are husband and wife, 52 year old James Rush and 47 year old Wendy Rush. They were driving on Packerland Drive Friday night when their car was hit by an SUV. The driver, 27 year old Daniel Boucher, made his first court appearance today. NBC 26's Ashley Barnes was there. She joins us live from the newsroom with an update. I was too drunk to drive. Cassandra, that's what police say. Daniel Boucher, the accused driver, told them after that crash that killed two people. Now, this afternoon, Boucher made his court appearance in a wheelchair, showing injuries oh, from that crash. And all, he's facing six counts, two from that homicide. The other four revolving around Boucher's driving privileges being revoked after two previous OWIs. Now, police say this crash should have never happened. Just a terrible, terrible tragedy, and our hearts go out to their family. And the family of the victims releasing a statement saying they are devastated by the loss of both Jim and Wendy, who were heavily involved in the community. And the statement also thanks to Green Bay Police and local community for helping the family through a difficult time. And right now, the family says they are focusing on the needs of the children. Both are students at Pulaski High School. And the school will also have a crisis team on hand tomorrow for students that may be affected. Keeping you connected, Ashley Barnes, NBC 26. James and Wendy Rush left behind two children. If you'd like to help the family, a GoFundMe page has been set up. You can find it on our website, NBC26.com. Just click on the story about the family releasing a new statement.